Oliver is a marketer at Supremo Global. He is tasked with account planning to create a marketing campaign. He wants to target and engage the right customers with relevant content in order to generate strong leads for sales. Oliver does this by using Oracle Eloqua to orchestrate a multi-step campaign. He begins on the campaign canvas where he adds a segment. He picks the criteria and chooses the segment members he wants to go after. Then by using either a new or existing filter, Oliver is able to set the segmentation criteria that will be used to feed contacts into his campaign. Only contacts that fit his specific criteria will be entered into the campaign. On the campaign canvas, Oliver selects a new white paper asset to drive engagement. He adds campaign steps to send an email to those that download the paper. He knows email is not always the best channel for everyone. He selects a different channel to engage the leads who do not open the email. For this campaign, Oliver selects LinkedIn matched audiences. Oliver revisits the segment and considers adding data pulled from profile data and digital body language to further refine the segment. Oliver now revisits the content that he wants to place within his campaign. Using the responsive Eloqua design editors, he is able to build out his email and landing page that will display dynamic content based on the digital behavior of the recipient. Oliver decides to use lead scores as filters for better targeting with specific types of campaigns or actions. He sets the weight factor for the multiple lead score components. He knows that these dynamic lead scores, driven by data, are key to optimizing timing and personalization. The lead score components he can factor in are based on both profile and engagement data, including digital footprint. This enables him to predetermine and automate the next appropriate interaction with each lead. By using this advanced lead scoring, he can more accurately target the right company and the right contact at the right time. Sophia has spent weeks researching tech solutions for her company. Moving down her short list of tech providers, she lands on Supremo's website. She begins to look for thought leadership content to determine if Supremo is one of the top technology providers for the solution she needs. She finds a white paper that looks interesting. She clicks and is directed to a gated page that prompts for a title and email to gain access. She's intrigued by the white paper and interacts with the data sheet, high value content, on the website. Her digital behavior begins building a lead score and places her into a nurture campaign. She later receives both a Supremo email and a LinkedIn ad with the same information. The LinkedIn ad goes deeper into the white paper topic and points to more resources. She digs into the new information, and by end of day, she is engaged with enough high-value content and develops a lead score of A1. Sophia's lead score is based on the profile data and her digital footprint. Her job title is an exact profile target match and places her in the A category for profile. After consuming high-value content, her engagement level climbed to 1. This meant that her total Eloqua lead score had become A1, making her a marketing qualified lead. In less than one minute, her information is pushed into the CRM as a lead and sales is notified. Jenna uses Oracle Engagement Cloud to prioritize the leads that get pushed from Eloqua. Her dashboard shows a running list of her leads. She sets criteria to filter for the leads she wants to review. She finds a new lead in her workflow, Sophia Smith. To get more info on Sophia, she views the lead summary and sees that Sophia is an A1 lead. Jenna is very excited to learn more about Sophia's digital footprint and to begin engaging her. Jenna uses Eloqua Profiler to view behavioral data on our new lead. The profile dashboard shows all of Sophia's engagement and Jenna notices that her email opens are low. Jenna decides to set up an alert email for when Sophia is next on the website. She will use this timing to engage Sophia directly on an alternative channel. On the road, Jenna receives an email alert that Sophia is on the website again. 
She checks Profiler to see if there was any specific content Sophia opened that she can refer to when speaking with her. She can easily review Sophia's information because the exact customer journey and content interactions are updated in real time. Jenna pulls Sophia's contact information and begins using Eloqua Engage to create a communication using marketing approved templates provided to the sales team. She personalizes an email based on the latest information in Profiler. She sends an invite asking Sophia to meet and discuss how Supremo can help. She later receives a reply from Sophia, who agrees to meet and suggests Jenna come to her office the following day to discuss a contract. The meeting with Jenna was very positive. Sophia signs a contract and begins her journey with Supremo as a new account.